Over the last several seasons, Paulding has had Lincoln View's number on the hardwood as the top-ranked Knights had lost five of their last six to the Panthers. So you can understand why Crestview would be riding high after Tuesday night's 10-point win at home over their rivals to the north. Paulding rebounded tonight, getting a win at home over Lincoln View. So apparently the golden megaphone curse is over for the Lancers as they did beat Wayne Trace with the golden megaphone. Fall on the road tonight. But celebration time is over for Lincoln View, and celebration time is over for the Crestview Knights as the NWC League leaders head to Bluffton this evening. Tie-dye Friday, making it up to Bluffton. <laughs> Fantastic. Fourth quarter action, Knights in front, Preston Zaleski to Damian Helm. Helm squeezes it in, muscles it up. 15-point lead for the top-ranked team in the state. Pirates come back, though. Joel Seeker to Levi Kissler. Eyes it flies at three is good. 40-28 Bluffton trailing. Zaleski, baseline pass to Tyson Bolenbaugh goes off blast. Back up to a 42-28 advantage. Then on the inbounds, Connor Lotzenheiser left wide open. Hits the 311 for Lotzenheiser. It's 45-28, but the Pirates come back. Austin Bricker drives, gets in the lane, goes off glass to bring the Pirates back within 15. More from Bricker as he's just getting started. Another drive, jump step. Finds the bucket. They would cut the lead to eight, but Crestview would go on and win by 13. 53-40 the final. Helm leading the way for the Knights with 16 points as they remain undefeated.